Hi there, I'm Brooke um, from MacArthur Public Library in Biddeford, Maine, and today I'm going to be showing you how to use tools in Cloud Library to search for ebooks and e audiobooks from the Maine State Download Library. First off, you'll open Cloud Library and tap or click on Search at the bottom to begin looking for books. The screen that you start out on has a number of featured lists, which can be very helpful if you're not exactly sure what you're looking for and you want to browse. Um, there are some specific categories. The main Student Book Award nominees, this is this year's current list, um, and you can see there's some that are available right now, there are some that you could put on hold. Um, and then the Always Available Indie Author Project is right up there at the top. These are always available um, because there's no limits on how many people can have them checked out at a time. Um, and then further down, there's some that are sort of like what's new by age range and genre. So um, just if you want to have a look at sort of what's out there, that can be a good spot to start. To customize um, your age range and favorite genres, you can tap or click on favorites and make selections. You tap that pencil icon to edit it. And um, you can decide on what age range you're looking for. You can do more than one. Um, you can say whether you prefer fiction or nonfiction, and then it uh, narrows it down to these categories that are sort of like genre or type of books. So you can select from that list um, and click save, and it'll show you what those are. All, which is just to the right of favorites up at the top, will show you all of the selections you've made and kind of by subgenre that are there. So um, that allows you to narrow it down some. Also very useful is the filter tool, which you can find by clicking that funnel shape up on the top right. And this will allow you to narrow your search down um, by format, so ebooks or audiobooks or both, um, depending on what you're looking for. The other thing that's handy in there is available now, which are titles that are actually available to check out right now. So if I click that, and I refresh it by pulling down the page, you see it loads. And now those are titles that are available right now to check out. So if you're looking for something now and you don't wanna wait, that's what you wanna do. Um, all library titles will show you what, what the library has available. It might be checked out, but you can put it on hold. Suggestions for library is an interesting one. This is if you look up a title and the library doesn't have it, um, it will say suggest and what you're doing if you click suggest is you're recommending it for purchase from the main or for the the main state download library um, if you do that and you you'd like for them to purchase it or you're asking that they will you just want to make sure that you you put um, your email address in under notifications because if they do get it for the library then it'll be put on hold for you and they'll notify you that way um, so these are some of the basics of how to do this. Those filters will stay intact until you take them off, so you can go in and, and change them around at any time or remove them if you want to. Um, and those are just sort of the basics of some of these searching um, tools that are available. So if you need more help, you have more questions, please give us a call at MacArthur Library um, or an email. We're happy to help out in whatever way we can. Thanks.